Oh my god, it's the prince. Oh, blood, blood hangs heavy on the air. You had a facelift? Plastic Young surgery? Too. Haircut? Squirming larva of the wretched brood who stole their immortality. Tell me, fledgling, are you scared? Do I frighten you? Is my knowledge of you unnerving? No, but knowledge of that suit is unnerving. Jesus, dude, seriously. Did someone just come over and slap you with a bad wardrobe or what? Oh, child of Cain, the sights in this haven pale in comparison to my ancestral estate. That's good, because I killed all your dudes. Comfort is a custom, and all of this artifice brings me closer to my home. Do not fear for my furniture, young one. Your furniture is kind of creepy, dude. It's made out of human skin. You shouldn't be doing that. You know, you did used to be human too. Even, well, unless you are actually Preston, then you're just a creepy predator guy. Oh, yes. Oh, tape, right. The tape. tape. Merely a test. Uh huh. Certainly not intended to fall into mortal hands. Why on earth did you record it, you dummy? Fortunately, we are in the capital of mortal trickery and illusion. So did the tape drive you to find me? From whence flows your longing, child? Yeah. I'm longing to kick your ass, Vlad. So, what's going on? To gouge out the eyes of the Camarilla. His name's Andre, by the way. Not good, Vlad. My creations. If you play League of Legends, I you'll see why I call him Vlad. In a minute. drive the Nosferatu from their pestilent nests. Without the sewer rats to guide them. The Camarilla will be blind to the Sabbat's designs. <laughs> ah, so you're one of those Sabbat assholes. And this is your plan? To what? Make creepy furniture that makes the sort of New York guy killer from Shadow Shadow Man like look even worse? It's it like not that, for me. It's for the will man. of the Sabbat. Hmm? The Camarilla is stunted. Dead and festering in the womb. Good only as pawns of the fathers. Even now, they answer the call of the ancient and seek to free him from his torpor. Man, this guy likes his long-winded, weird, sort of flamboyant speeches. He's all like, yes, I am he stupid. He slumbers within the uncurrent sarcophagus. One of the fathers whose return shall hearken the reckoning. Guhena is at hand, and the Camarilla are unwittingly speeding us all toward our doom. How on earth do you move outside with that head of yours? You look like a spider mated with a plate of spaghetti. Yeah, whatever, you're boring me. Time to die. You could talk about the creatures, actually. I should probably do that. Blessed creatures. I have broken through their mortal crust and drawn from them their greatest strength. Mutability. I Coax a bone, weave flesh, and lay sinew tight until it strains to lash out. Uh huh. Yeah, they are very ugly. Perhaps, but they are exquisitely functional. Not really, I crushed them with a the hammer. Still, there's an uncanny elegance to even this, my most mercenary of designs. What are you, some like sort of artist at the Weird Bondage Club or what? Jeez. <laughs> yeah, man, you must be really delusion, uh, deluded, and I've just got what the doctor ordered. A hammer. Now, Camarilla Welp, let me see you fight your nature in the face of those who have embraced their beast. Deny yourself Cain's gifts, and be torn asunder by my minions. Deny yourself your head, because I'm about to tear you asunder with my hammer up your anus. Bring it. Oh no, not the Tamishmish. Tameshkish? Smidish? Tameshmish? Oh no, what will everyone do? Smash you with a hammer! Yes! Oh no, I'm not gonna get killed by you. Smash you with a hammer. Bye, Vlad. See what he does? He does the whole pool of blood thing that Vlad does. Oh no, not these people, guys. Oh, take that, arm. Oh, sure. In downside, we got a nice shield on because of the defense. And, quite honest, the only thing we can't do really is we can't break it. Where's that we got? Oh, Andre. Oh no, we can! Oh, oh, Andre! Oh, don't pick up all that blood, bro. Oh no. Oh, I'm sorry. 
you know, fun facts, uh, fun fact folks, if you like fun facts for funness, Andre actually calls into the radio show, The Deb of Night, and he talks about the end of the world, and but just Deb isn't impressed, because she's too boss, she's like, Andre, you suck, uh, basically, like, I like Femizak better, Femizak is awesome, whoop, come on Andre, you piece of crap, oh, stop telling him to the other end of the room, like, some massive douche, yeah, you can puke up blood again, oh, no, yep, even though you have a head that looks like a scary walrus, we'll still die. Knob off. Yay, 6 XP you say, for kicking the crap out of Spooky McSpooky. Hello. What's going on here then? Why are your entrails hanging out? What's going on? Yeah. Oh, right, we're leaving. Ooh, sewers. Now, just to warn you, kind, kind, lovely watching people. This isn't the most exciting bit of the game, if I'm completely honest with you. In fact, I would say it is quite tedious and unreasonably long. But luckily, I have a cure for quite tedious and unreasonably long. It's called... Whoa, buckling frame rate. Okay, unreasonable frame rate is knobbed off. Oh no, it's coming back. What? Okay. So we crawl through the pipe. Um, we will stop here for today, because we can cover the sewers next time. Hello. Yo, Arms McGee, how's it going, man? Yeah. Oh, fine, you go that way. There's a dead guy here. He has a gun. And some notes. Anyway, the sewers, yes. Uh, next time it's going to be a bit of double speed again because I don't want to skip the sewers, but I also don't want to put you through the torture of having to watch all of it really slowly. Imagine something very, very slow, like William Shatner talking, but much slower than that, with more pauses to his speech. You know, that kind of thing. But then imagine all the sewer levels and every single game you hate put into one very long section full of annoying monsters and no dialogue and just irritating bits. And you have the sewers of Vampire! Yay! And it even has a puzzle, and I use the term lightly, which is pull a switch and run really fast with a zero frame rate because it's a weird source engine error. Enjoy! So with that, I bid you adieu. And until next time, we have Chipmunky, hopefully. As long as I remember. If I don't, you'd be really bored. But oh god, Halloween, why don't you make this faster? Come on, Arms McGee, you can do it. The more you run at me like a cretin, the more you can get through. Yay! Thanks for watching. Bye.